Hi everyone. So I finally broke this tent out. I've had it for a while, probably about a year, and I've never even tried it out. It's finally here in uh, North Carolina. It's finally starting to cool off. So I thought I would try it out. Um, definitely, it's the type of thing you need to like use this stuff ahead of time. Because if this was an emergency, as simple as this really is to set up overall, the first time you do it, it's not going to be that simple. And, you know, I, I had to figure it out. But, uh, it's a 6x5 little tent. It's, uh, it can sleep too. And you can see I got my Coleman sleeping bag that's rated for 30 degrees. Tonight's only supposed to go down to about 53 degrees, so I'll be fine. That fabric, and I'll show you here, this is something I salvaged. It's got foam in the middle of it. And, uh, you know, I'm using that so I don't have to sleep directly on the ground. I've got some, you know, I'm cheating a little bit with those pillows. And if you go around, you'll see there is a rain catch. Um, I'm not expecting any bad weather, but, we'll, you know, we'll see what happens got my second B in the tent already so I'm gonna work on getting him out of there but this is uh, what I'm planning to do tonight if you watch some of my other bushcraft videos just you'll know that's my fire starting kit I've got a fire set up not for warmth I'm planning to cook some food out here tonight and I got some backup wood there there's my Coleman uh, propane light and you can see I got plenty of wood stacked up there. And I'm out here with, uh, you know, we say two is one and one is none. So I've got three flashlights, I've got three knives, and I do have two guns, my AR-15 and my Ruger 9mm. The last time I was out in the woods, I did come across a poisonous snake, which I shot. There were actually two snakes. And I had slept back there once before but I, I started looking up on Google. Somebody mentioned in my comments that was a copperhead. And this is, it turns out this is prime time for copperheads to be mating. And there is a stream back there which they like to be near. So I'm, I'm just gonna camp out right here near my house, which you can see I've got plenty of woods and I can shoot my guns back here. Um, another thing about being prepared, I wanted my headlamp for tonight, when I, I want to film, I am going to film tonight, but I wanted my headlamp and I have an emergency kit in my car, an emergency kit in my house, and a bug out bag, and I was not able to locate it easily, you know, in fact I just gave up on it, I only have one headlamp, and so, you know, really you got to keep track of your stuff where it is, so when you, you need it, you have it. But anyway, I'll show you what's going on tonight. I'm gonna to cook some food over the fire and just try and relax out here under the stars tonight. Thanks for watching.